Why do managers at restaurants think that superior training equals superior employees? Yeah, I'm bitching about my, my other job that I'm about to quit because it's gay. I'm in economics concentration, so let's look at this from a supply and demand perspective. Florida State has 50,000 students, 20,000 at TCC. How many at FAMU? Another 20,000? Supply is high, demand is low. But there's a lot of problems with the situation. Money is the ultimate motivating factor. Anyone that ignores this principle is a fool. So I'm not going to name any names in this episode of the Michael Rant Bitching Show. You know, I'm sitting here bitching and moaning about the situation, but ultimately, you know, I'm just being lazy about not finding another job. Why do I need another job? Because I'm money hungry. I'm a capitalist. Adam Smith, Wealth of Nations, you should read it. It was published in the 18th century. It talks about how there's always going to be a poor person, there's always going to be a rich person. I want to be a rich person. I don't really want to be a doctor. I don't want to be a lawyer. I don't want to be a physical therapist. I don't want to be a missionary. I just want to be filthy fucking rich. Yacht, car, Maserati. Is that too much to ask? To be a millionaire? I don't think it is. So that's your economics lesson for tonight. I know this probably isn't a very interesting confessional, but I just wanted to get that off my chest, you know.